Hi, this is Jay. Welcome to Bright Ideas. Here are the eight types of curriculum in the school by Alan Glathorn. Number one, recommended curriculum. The recommended curriculum is that which is recommended by scholars and professional organizations. It also encompasses the curriculum requirements of policymaking groups such as DeepEd, CHED, and DOST. It is a curriculum that stresses oughtness, identifying the skills and concepts that ought to be emphasized according to the perceptions and value systems of the sources. Number two, written curriculum. The written curriculum is intended to ensure that the educational goals of the system are being accomplished. It is a curriculum of control. Typically, the written curriculum is much more specific and comprehensive than the recommended curriculum, indicating a rationale that supports the curriculum, the general objectives should be studied, and the kinds of learning activities that should be used. The written curriculum is an important component of authentic literacy, the ability to read, write, and think effectively. Number three, taught curriculum. The taught curriculum is a delivered curriculum, a curriculum that an observer sees in action as the teacher teaches. The taught curriculum is at which the teacher actually delivered day by day. Number four, supported curriculum. It includes those resources that support curriculum, like textbooks, software, and other media. Number five, assessed curriculum. The assessed curriculum is that which appears in test and performance measures, like state test, standardized test, district test, and teacher-made test. Number six, learned curriculum. It is the bottom line curriculum, the curriculum that students actually learn. It denotes all the changes in values, perceptions, and behavior that occur as a result of school experiences. Number seven, hidden curriculum. This is the unintended curriculum. It defines what students learn from the physical environment, the policies, and the procedures of the school. Here is an example. Each week, teachers in an elementary school devote 250 minutes to reading and 50 minutes to art. Students learn this lesson. In this school, art is not considered very important. Number eight, null curriculum. This refers to various curriculum contents or topics that must not be taught to students.